Let's go get my mom and sister over to the villa. And Bonjour, there's guys here. Noizio. How could you leave a Firenze without saying a proper goodbye? Ezio! What do you want, Vieri? So many things. A larger palazzo, two new steeds, a prettier bride. Oh, and yes, your life. My condolences. Dude, mouth movement is so weird. What will happen now that there's no one left to help you? I have such wonderful things in store for your mother and sister. I grow tired of this game. Finish him and do not spare the women. Ooh. What sorcery is this? <laughs> not sorcery, boy. Skill. <gasps> Show yourself. Who's As that? You wish. Here, use this. Kill them. Kill them all. Mr. One-Eyed Man. Alright, can I actually move? Alright. This is kinda easy, we're just stabbing them in the back. Is there a, like a... Oh, what is that? Okay, I guess I can change my weapon. <laughs> nice. You have my thanks. Keep the sword, Ezio. Do I know you from somewhere? Don't you recognize me? It's-a me, Mario! Uncle Mario? <clears throat> it's been too long, Nipote. Far too long. I heard what happened in Firenze. Terrible. Come, let's get you all away from here. I wonder if they named him that just to make that joke. Probably. Explore the villa. All right. So, tell me everything. They executed father for treason. Federico and Petruccio too. And they came for me. Do you know why? I have no answers, uncle. Only a list of names taken from a man who wished me dead. I still can't believe they are gone. Don't worry. We will make sense of this. I wish I shared your optimism. Come on, keep pace. We're almost there. I think you will find much to like in Monterigioni. I thought Monterigioni was an enemy of Firenze. <sighs> For now. Next year it will be its friend, the year after its enemy again, and on and on. I cannot keep track, so I have stopped trying. These are honest, hard-working people. Our shops may only carry simple goods, but they're well-made and dependable. There is a chapel here, too. The Prete seems a nice enough fellow, but... I've never been much of a believer. Did you know the Villa Auditore is almost 200 years old? It was built by my great-grandfather, a strange man who carried all kinds of secrets. Keep your eyes open, and you might discover a few of them yourself. With all the fighting that's been going on, this place has started to get a bit rough around the edges. I wish I could do something about it, but I just don't have the time or money to fix things up. Guess that's life, huh? Here we are, Casa Dolce Casa. So, what do you think? It's most impressive, Uncle. She's seen better days, I suppose. Believe me, I'd have her shining again if only I had the time. Now that you have had the tour, Nipote, you should go and outfit yourself. My men in the market are expecting you. Return here when you're finished, and we'll begin. Begin? Begin what? I thought you'd come here to train. No, uncle. I came here to escape Firenze. And I intend to take my family further still. But what about your father? He'd want you to finish his work. What work? 
My father was a banker. Wait, he did not tell you? I have no idea what you're talking about. Ma che mi convini, Giovanni? Where to even begin? Go and fetch the gear in the market. It will give me time to think. But... But that's that. We'll talk more later. Some spending money should you need it. And if you find yourself in need of rest, I've prepared a room for you on the top floor of the villa. All right, so we got some money. Let's go uh, give it to the shop and do what he wants us to do. I don't know exactly. I think he just wants us to look around, get used to the layout. This is going to be my favorite part of the whole game. I already know it. All right, small weapons, dagger. Should we buy a dagger? Leather greaves? Um, I guess just get a dagger. All right. No offense, but I didn't think you had them on. Nice. Oh, I think they want us to buy the greaves. All right. Let me uh. Okay. Armor and buy the greaves. All right. So there's that repair. We I don't need it. To cool. All right. So now I think he wants us back. Oh no! Visit the doctor. Oh yeah, we get medicine for auto healing. Apothecary supplies, medicine. There we go. Just yep. Buy it all. Farewell and swift recovery, amico. Nice. All right. So. Anything else, or are we going back? Alright. So, let's head up. This is a sweet fountain. Like, I really like this fountain, just looking at it. Let's just, uh, let's get a little screenshot. Okay, I guess not. A bunch of words are coming up open your inventory and manage items and equipment I don't really think I need to do that right now um let's go up and synchronize let's do this go up up this window over the ledge I'm probably just skip that area by going up here up to this and there you go where is it this side and synchronize it's a really pretty area and leap I like the view yeah me too 10 out of 73 that's a lot all right, let's go talk don't to worry. them. We're only staying here for a little while. I don't like it here. I want to go home. I know. <laughs> I know. And then just cut it off completely. All right, let's go talk to, I think, Mario. All right, let's talk. Salute, uncle. I did as you asked. And quickly too, pan fatto. Now, let's teach you how to fight. No. As I said, we are leaving. Ezio, you barely held your own against Vieri. You won't survive a week on the road. If you want to leave, so be it. But at least do so armed with the skills and knowledge necessary to defend yourself. If not for me, for your mother and sister. Fine. Optimo. All right, let's learn how to fight. You can swing a sword to be sure, but offense alone will not carry a battle. You must survive long enough to strike. 
I will teach you how to dodge. You said my father was more than just a banker. No use dancing around it, I suppose. Your father was an assassin at you. I told you before. My father was a paper pusher. Benny, I've taught you how to avoid your enemy's attacks. Now you'll learn how to turn them to your advantage. I mean, All those were trash uh, and dodges, but it reeks of fantasy. Hold like something from an old part covered in arcane writing. How did you know? You have your father's blade. I figured you have the codex cage he was holding as well. Codex. See, a guy in the inner work of the order. Okay. Still trying to get used to it. Our creed, if you will. Your father believed the codex contained a powerful secret. Something that would change the world. Avanti, stai on Ayano. General leader made it. Okay. Odio questi momenti di incertezza. Mi attacchi tu o attacco io. I don't understand the point of taunting. Today I'm going to teach you how to position yourself in battle. Where you stand and how you It's like yeah, you're just kind of spending time not fighting. Don't think I haven't seen you picking apart my library. I trust you believe me now? Yes. My father was an assassin. But why the need for such secrecy? Are you familiar with the Templars? One of several knightly orders formed during the Crusades. History teaches they were disbanded nearly 200 years ago in France. Only they weren't. Merely pushed underground, where they continued their nefarious work. Finish him off, I guess. There we go. Well done, Nepote. You've really come into your own. Thank you, Uncle, for all you have given me. Your family. Such is my duty and my desire. I'm glad you had me stay. Good. You've reconsidered leaving. We sail for Spain in three days. But Nepote. I have given you these skills that you might be better prepared to strike against our enemies. And if they find me, I will. You want to leave Ezio? To throw away everything your father fought and died for? To deny your heritage? Fine! Come voi. Arrivederci e buona fortuna. Uncle, wait! Why is he so upset? How can he not be? Vieri's been harassing us ever since you first arrived. To be expected, I suppose. Given his heritage. Okay, so Mario is angry that I don't want to be an assassin. But really, who can blame me? Let's go talk to Mario. Uncle! Where is everyone? They ride for San Gimignano to slay that snake, Vieri. I wish to join them. You'll find what you need at the stables. All right, so time to go get a horse. See, see this part? This is going to be my favorite part of the game. This was my favorite part in Unity and in Syndicate and really, um, really any game that has an economy like that, that you can manage and do all that. It's always my favorite. Wait, is this on the outside or inside? Alright, I guess I missed it. I was too busy trying to go outside. Then I missed... Alright, where is it? What am I supposed to do? Is it upstairs? It's probably upstairs. Alright... 
There it is. Yep. It's mom. Ezio, look at her. I still can't get her to talk. She spends all day and night in front of those feathers Petruccio used to collect. She can't let them go. I don't know what to do. Don't worry. She'll come back to us. I know it. All right. Um, place collected feathers into the chest. Got a couple. We got one. Okay, never mind. All right. So now I think it's time to go out to the horses. Got some fighting going on. I can practice. And then going past the blacksmith. Let's see what they have for now. Um weapons. Ooh. The Falchion. Warhammer. Syrian sword. Hmm. Speed is high, but deflect is down. Could probably go with this one. Um, I don't know if I really need it though right now, so hey, I think I'll pass. I didn't think so. All right, let's move out. Ah, don't be shy. I, I don't remember how good the horse riding was, but we'll see. Press X on it. Alright, let's move out. I think it's this way. Hey, there we go. Stick to the trails. Okay, never mind. You go really fast when you're holding X. Uh, X. Alright, Tuscany. San something. Jimigiano. Jimigiano. I don't know. I can't. I don't have that. That flare to my tongue, clearly. Alright, let's go. They're in this, these little houses or whatever. Where is he? Is he out here? Or is it further? Oh, it's actually, it's further. I know that it was in some houses. Is it in here? Yep, it's in here. Okay, let's um just park them off to the side. Speak to Monk. My uncle. Taking responsibility. Vieri troubles you because of me. <laughs> Vieri troubles us because he's a Templar and we are assassins. Either way, I wish to help. Va bene. Then listen close. First, we must find a way inside the city, though it seems Vieri expects us. He has sealed the gates and sent his men to guard them. Fortunately for us, the city is larger than his host. The southern gate suffers for it, so this is where we'll strike, Pronte. Nice. Alright, so now we're kill killing that uh, Vieri guy. Vieri di Pazzi. Let's go run up with my uncle and these unnamed men that are probably either going to die or be forgotten. All right, Ezio. Here's how it is going to work. My men and I will distract the guards. Once we have engaged them, get yourself over the wall and find a way to open the gate. Take these throwing knives. Use them to dispatch the archers. I'm ready when you are. Then let us begin. Al attacko! Press R1 to throw daggers. Alright. Easy enough. Wait, what? Um... Daggers, right? Well, 
Wait, what? Throw knife. Oh, there we go. Damn, that arm though. Alright, where's the other one? This one? I think that's it, right? Okay. Can I... Can't lock on over here. Nope. Probably just have to go right next to him. And there we go. Let's uh, see how much he has for now. Probably not much. Yeah. I don't think I'm going to do that anymore. It's not worth it. Alright guys. Come on in. Hello. Alright. Finally. Well done, Taking your time. I want you to distract those guards and keep them from raising the alarm. Hopefully it will buy me enough time to find and silence Vieri. Va bene. Wait, Nipote. Take a few of my men with you, just to be safe. Come join me once they're dealt with. Alright. Let's get our sword out. But something has him on edge. How else to explain all the patrols? A signal again when you should follow. All right, I mean, we're just here to kill him, right? Grab him and kill him. my sword. There we go. Alright, chill. Jesus. These guys. Are they falling? Alright. My sword. Wait. Oh, that's just uh, one of those notoriety pages. I don't think I need to take those down. I need to remember to hold R2 and press X, because that's how you escape that little, uh, what's it called? Alright, talk. Ezio, your uncle's under attack and needs help. Go to him. Okay. Where, though? Okay, let's, um, let's get the hidden blade out. Hell yeah. There we go. A couple more guys. I really don't need to be doing this, but... My brothers and I will deal with these guys. I want you to go on ahead and root out that snake. See that justice is done. Find Vieri. Okay. Let's get out of here. What's this? Oh, okay. A little loot box. 
Nice. Where should we run, though? I think it's... Is it this way? Where is it? Is it in here? I think so. Alright, let's keep going. We'll probably get there pretty soon, just going through here. I don't think I need to mess around with them. Yeah, it's right there. Just have to climb up to it. Oh, uh, it's right... yeah. It's settled. Vieri, you will remain here to coordinate the mercenary. Francesco will organize our forces in the city and send word when it's time to strike. Jacopo, your job is to calm the citizens once the deed is done. What of that Ubriacone Mario? He continues to harass my forces, and I fear he'll discover what we intend. He's always been trouble, just like that bastardo brother of his. Then let me reunite them, father. There will be plenty of time to clean up the refute when we're finished. Now, is there anything else? Muy bien. May the Father of Understanding guide you. May, May the, the Father, Father of, of Understanding, understanding guide you. Comandante! Comandante! What? Mario Auditore has invaded the city. He comes for you. <laughs> then let's not keep him waiting. What a little brat kid. Okay. Um, I think he's over here, right? Yeah. He's that kid. Alright. Let's drop down then. Okay. Skip them. Try to climb the wall. Never mind. Climb up. Nice. Alright. Let's get our hidden blade out. Let's go over here. Fear not, Ezio. I'll make sure your death comes quick. What? Alright, get the sword out then. Nice. There we go. Alright, I'm trying. Damn. Alright. There we go. Viri's all alone. There we go. Damn. What are you and your allies planning? Is this what my father discovered? Is this why he was killed? I'm sorry. Were you hoping for a confession? Pezzo di merda! Vorrei solo che avesse sofferto di più! 
Hai avuto la fine che meritavi! Spero che è brutto! Enough, Ezio! Show some respect. Respect? After all that's happened, do you think he would have shown either of us such kindness? You are not Fieri. Do not become him. Che la morte ti dia le pace che cercavi. Requiesca in pace. Requiesca in pace. Read it when you have the time. Our work here is finished. Let us return to the villa. If there's any Italian that I've if that I've learned from this game, it's Requiesca in pace. All right, what's going on? Codex page acquired. Oh yeah, the codex pages. I think we need to give those to um, Leonardo. I think so. All right, and we are back in the city. Let's see what's uh, what's at the shop. Armor. Yeah, some more stuff. Heimschild grids. Ooh, these are cool. Perhaps later. Ciao. All right, let's go see what what they want. Where are you at? There he is. And here he is, our campione Ezio. Oh, oh hey, hey Ezio. Ezio! I see you've wasted no time starting the celebration. And why not? You've done us a great service, Nipote. With Vieri dead, La Toscana will grow quiet once more. Do you know what that means? Basta lavorare. Si passa tutto il giorno a bere. E a puttane. What? It's true. <laughs> <laughs> Come, Ezio. Walk with me. Yes, uncle. All right. A change of plans. Learn about the villa and discover the codex pages. The Pazzi answer to another. Spaniard. He is Rodrigo Borgia, one of the most powerful men in all of Europe, and leader of the Templar Order. Which makes him responsible for the murder of my father and brothers. Yes, and he will kill you too, given the chance. Then I must stand against him if I wish to be free, but not until every other Templar has fallen to my blade. Father's list will guide me. Where will you go next? Firenze. Francesco de Pazzi will share the fate of his son. A sensible next step. No doubt he intends evil for the city. All right, that's enough grim talk for one night. I'll be in my study if you need me. All I shall right. read the letter my uncle gave me. That's enough grim talk for now. Where is it? Hey, just dropping in. Look familiar? On oh, their codex pages. Yes, your father managed to find and translate a few before he... Here. This is not your father's work. Someone else has translated it. Leonardo da Vinci, a friend. Do you see the way the words cross from one page to the next? There nope. There's something underneath it all. Some kind of map. Where is it supposed to lead? Your father and I managed to make out bits of a prophecy scrawled across these pages. It was written by an assassin like us, who long ago held a piece of Eden. His name was Altair. He spoke of something powerful and ancient hidden beneath the land. What is it? What indeed? Solving that little mystery is exactly why we collected these pages. Then let me help. It's time I take on my father's work. All of it. I'll start with the page I took from Vieri. Leonardo will decode it for us. Ben, return here when time permits and we'll add it to the wall. 